Um, to public speaking, I must defer to number one speaker of the house, Elaine, and to my daughter and my son, who are accomplished speakers in their own right. I want to thank you all for helping me to celebrate on the auspicious occasion of my 90th birthday. Actually, this is a command performance of our fellness. Uh, I've just been certified. I've just been certified by the archivist or archivist of our fellness family of the website as to the oldest living fellness in the United States. Yay! My light went off. <laughs> with with <laughs> David. The light went off there. <laughs> Just the last Tech support. Tech, Tech support. Call <laughs> <laughs> it help. You all are. You all are aware of my feelings about family togetherness, and I love you all, and God bless you all. My camp. Personal Rabbi Aaron is sorely missed. That's all I have to say. I love you all. We love you. And God bless you all. Thank you. Um, you know, um, what, watching you manage people in, in Brooklyn Letter and work with people in Brooklyn Letter taught me how to, how to manage and work with people. It set me up in a whole different way uh, for handling the kinds of jobs and responsibilities that I carried because I saw how it was the right way to deal with people. And you taught me an awful lot, the way you... The way you would lend them money, the way you would, uh, you know, coddle them and then yell at them when it was necessary and, and the like. You really, really did well. With me, you mostly yell, but that's another story. I remember, I remember that I couldn't sit down. Every time I would sit down at the office in Brooklyn Letter, he said, get off your ass, you're my son. So he'd make me, he'd make me stand up. Don't say that. Uh, but also what you taught us about family and, and uh, family and uh, 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 the importance of keeping everyone together and how you reach out to people on a regular basis, come on, yeah. how you reach out to people on a regular basis, family, even if they don't want to be reached, you reach out to them, and you make sure that the connection uh, stays there. You taught us an awful lot, and we have, a, we have a, a lot of good things to follow from, from watching the way that you lived your life and got you to your 90th birthday as the oldest living uh, film. filmist. So <laughs> congratulations. Cheers. Cheers. All Cheers. Best, and may there be many, many more. Kind of said it. I, I know that my work ethic comes from you. Uh, when I would come to work with you, it was my most fun time, you know, take your daughter to work. It didn't okay. have to be a special day. Uh, I knew I was getting tuna fish from the greasy spoon down the street, and that was just fine with me! Casey okay. Diner. Casey Diner. Casey. I wrapped that pickle up. Oh, it was so good. Talk louder? Okay. So, can you hear me? Yes. Yes, of course you can. Uh, but it, it was directly it? responsible for the way I work, is that I have pride in what I do, and it's not okay to do anything less than better than what anybody else can do. So it's killing me, but thanks, because I know that I always distinguish myself wherever we go and uh, wherever I work. And I want to thank you for all the other things, just, just a sense of family and keeping sh sh kids close and... Um, you know, doing for your children in the way that you did for us, and I appreciate that. Ben. And for accepting right. That's good. I have always loved you, Anna. You have always. I, can't I have it. always loved you. We know that. You are my favorite uncle. You always were my favorite uncle. Now the course, only one. Yeah, well, <laughs> but even before you were the only one, you were my favorite one. And part of the reason that I have always been willing to share my blueberry pie with you. <laughs> At my birthday parties, you were the only one I would ever let have a set in peace. Um, is that I always knew you loved me. And that's been very important to me. So keep on loving me. And I will keep on loving you. You are the best. You are the best. You are the best. You are the best. You would have responded. You didn't hear it. With both my parents gone, I just wanted to know you.
folk band, and you've been very special to me and my children and my wife. And I was trying to, with working six days a week, I, I, put, I was trying to put an album together. And of course, I'm not totally done, but I was getting together pictures that I enlarged. I have all the pieces. I just had to put them together. And, and I was looking through them, and I realized you were at my Jews Chris, oh, you were at the East Bar Mitzvah, all the birthday parties for my children, and you were always there. I could always count on you. You know how much it meant to my children and, and myself. You were really, I mean, you are like a grandfather and father, and you're really special in our lives. And I thank you for that. That makes me feel very good. I, don't, I feel a warmth. I don't know if it's the two margaritas I have. <laughs> <laughs> but I love you all. You're my family, and we got to stick together. That's what family is all about, and gatherings like this, and, and we get together. And now at least we're telling each other how much we love each other, so it's wonderful. I, I wish our government would work like this. <laughs>